the uh, new generation of antibiotics is uh, on the way they are called uh, dual acting immuno antibiotics daia dual acting immuno antibiotics the problem with the present generation of antibiotics is that the <clears throat> microbes quickly generate resistance to these antibiotics and they are no longer effective once resistance is developed that's why the thought process uh, in terms of dual acting immuno antibiotics which not only destroy the <coughs> microbes but also <coughs> build uh, immunity or resistance against uh, microbes and prevent the microbes from developing resistance to the antibiotic so fundamentally <coughs> uh, how they act a little bit of science is that uh, they actually inhibit the mep pathways the methyl d erythritol phosphate or the non mevalonate pathway uh, <clears throat> see what all this means is the uh, microorganisms need to synthesize uh, the isoprenoids Uh, which uh, are an essential part of their metabolism. Uh, <clears throat> these are actually required for the microorganisms uh, <clears throat> to uh, survive. Uh, it's part of their metabolism. So <clears throat> the ISPH enzymes are required for microorganisms to survive so a good number of isph enzyme inhibitors have been tried but unfortunately they couldn't penetrate the bacterial <coughs> wall and <coughs> act on their metabolic uh, pathway the new generation of uh, daias easily penetrate the bacteria and uh, Uh, prevent the isoprenoid formation and the <clears throat> new generation of isph inhibitors are thoroughly and totally effective so tomorrow you would see antibiotics which not only kill microbes but fortifies the immune system and prevent microbes from developing resistance thank you very much